Zenit is back, and this time with a full frame camera that can shoot full HD video. Hi, I'm Johnny from Cinema 5D, and I'm here with Andre from Zenit. Yeah. Andre, how are you? Fine, thanks. How are you? <laughs> I'm fine, thank you very much. So, uh, so Zenit, for people that doesn't know the company, a little bit about the history. Just that uh, our story is a very long story. We started like a Zenit uh, more than uh, 100 years ago. And since 1968, we are located in Krasnogorsk city, near Moscow. Making what? Making, uh, first of all, uh, camera lenses, but uh, during the short period of time, like uh, 20 years, we hasn't produced uh, cameras. So everything was shut off or actually it was a low key? You see, the problem was that in uh, uh, we we couldn't we couldn't catch the new stream and digital uh, camera, but uh, and that period of time, like 30 years, we, are, we have been producing only lenses, as it is. Okay. And now you're making a comeback with a new camera. It's there. And, and, <laughs> and the idea is to show that you're actually alive and kicking. So what's the name of the new camera? The new camera, it's a Zenit M camera. It's a 1.35, uh, it's a lens. We are cooperating, cooperation with uh, Leica camera. Okay, so the, the design or the outside design is yours and the interior of the camera is actually from Leica? Of course, because Leica is a leader of this market. They are very professional at this stuff and for us it's a stupid idea to start from scratch. And it's, it's a real cooperation because the product is really good. Can you disclose which Leica is actually living inside your box? You see, it's uh, not so easy. It, uh, it doesn't mean that Leica take something from your camera and put it inside our camera. Of course not, because it's absolutely different structure of uh, components, absolutely different uh, soft. It's a Russian soft here. And uh, it's, a, it's a cooperation between two big and famous companies, one in Germany and another in Russia. Okay, so the end result? will be a different texture for the picture. I mean, if I take this one, put it next to a Leica, the texture of the picture or video will be different? You see, it's very easy. If you visit a Leica camera uh, site, you, you won't find something like that. It's absolutely different picture. It's absolutely different type of uh, lenses. And as a result, different camera. Okay, so now we are uh, very interested on the video capabilities of this camera because we are catering our uh, filmmaker audience. I'm I am engineer. It's it's No 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 problem, but if you can tell me a little bit or I can ask you, hopefully you can answer about the video capabilities of this camera. This camera can also shoot video, yeah? Of course, of course. Very what, professional, in, you can see in our site. It's in what resolution? Up to full HD or 4K? Up to full HD. Up to full HD. How about frame rates? How high can we go? Does it have... I don't know. You don't know? Okay, we can check later, but... Uh, I don't know, you can check it and uh, you will have your own personal opinion. And I think the opinion will be good. Okay. <laughs> so, you told me a bit earlier that this camera actually is being sold now in a very limited... It's a limited edition. Yeah, it's how a very limited edition. How many edition. pieces will be actually produced? So, you see, it's uh, 500 items around the world. 450 it's a silver one and 50 the black one and the price in europe it will be 5.5 thousand uh, together camera and lenses which when you say lenses what lenses are you going to sell with this camera one uh, 35 so one single lens and the body it it will be together okay. camera and lenses yep. And the price, the final price, 5,500 okay. euros. Uh, I think it's also important to note that this is a full frame camera. Full frame, of course. And the the bayonet, the mount is? A mount, like a mount. A mount. Uh, okay, so presumably you sold all those pieces. What is the next step? 
The next step, it will be absolutely a new camera. Now we are speaking and we are working very hard with uh, guys from Leica company. And it will be absolutely new design, absolutely uh, new electronic components and uh, different type of lenses. This is camera just uh, shows that we are alive. The, we, we are ready to start our new era. Yes, together with famous company like Leica. And I think it will be great. Of course, it's, it's a very limited series. Is there any chance that your new camera will yeah. have 4K video, for example? Uh, I don't know. Too it's early to say. Very early. <laughs> How about the mount? Will it be still M mount or you will move to the L mount or you don't know? Uh, first of all, we are speaking uh, about the mount for like a camera. And uh, for example, after some times, you can buy lenses separately from camera if you already had like a camera and use it together. But uh, next year, we will start producing uh, for Nikon and Canon. Uh, camera and uh, I think it will be great because these lenses is uh, is a uh, perfectly well okay. just for me when should we uh, expect the next camera to be in the market more or less I mean it's a one year of development or two years of development where are we in the development I aspect? can say that uh, next uh, two lenses especially for this camera uh, will be at the start of the new year and uh, February or May, March it and the new camera New camera the end of next year. And uh, the new and two lenses will be one uh, by 50 and 2.8 by 21. Okay. And thank you very much for the information. Thank you. Actually, quite interesting, especially when you know something is kind of a new thing is born or reborn in your case. Wishing you all the best, all the luck. Thank you, for, thank you very much for watching, and please don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.